Welcome to the Metal Mix, it's the boy, it's the Don, DJ Ram on the channel, bringing you interviews and reactions and me on the channel. You know, we've been published all around the world. We've done interviews with bands like Trivium, Atreyu, Demi Borger, Mayhem, Judas Priest, Megadeth, all sorts of bands. And if you know the show, you know we throw our own heavy metal festivals like Hollow Fest and Metburn Metal Festival. We are here, we are here to do a first time reaction to Ophidian Breeze, super excited uh, uh, friend, a subscriber of the show. A uh, fellow metalhead um, sent me this amazing t-shirt. Check this out. It's like this chick fighting the devil, dude. Almost reminds me like of uh, Diablo in a sense. It says Perdition on the bottom. It's super sick. But you know what? They also have a website out. You should go check it out. OphidianBreeze.com I'll leave the link in the description below. And we are going to do a first time reaction. I do not know what to expect of the song. I don't know what genre this is. This is an official first time reaction. This could be black metal. This could be death metal. He could have he could have sent me a pop music. I have no idea. All I know is that I see a couple holding hands, and we're gonna see what it is. If you like this video, like and comment. And let me know what you think. I am super excited, um, and um, I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna rock out my Ophidian Breeze shirt this whole entire time, and it's super comfortable. By the way, go to their website. I'm sure they have shirts there. And they have all sorts of music that you could purchase and go support the page. Go So go check out OphidianBreeze.com. But let's react to this video. Here is Prelude Dark Flight here on the Metal Mixtape. Bad is about to happen. I hear two vocalists right there. Oh, 
kind of reminds me of like the Mars Volta a little bit. This video is like so far is like if Evanescence, Tool, Godsmack, and the Mars Volta had a baby. This would be it. Ophidian Breeze. <laughs> Love that right there. Interesting way to come back into the song. Interesting. Interesting. Empty shell with no place. Took my love, left no trace. To my plight, no single care. Sorry, not end endless dark light. Love it. Is that it? Ooh. Interesting. That, that twanginess on the guitar right at the end. What a trip. To be continued. I knew it. Okay, so um, one of the things, what what I love about it is saying it being uh, to be continued is that this straight up did feel like a comic. You know what I mean? The way they were going through it all. Um, all happiness, all love. All of a sudden, the couple, they're all, they look tormented. He looks hurt. He looks like he's about to pass away or it's, they're, they're just both going through some torment. You know, she was talking about being chained up and everything and going through torment. And then there's a hospital bed. The hospital's messy, by the way, unless you turn into a werewolf. Then you clean that up. Um, but um, so obviously somebody died. Because right in the next scene, she's at a graveyard. And she's talking about how she could, she could use him more than ever right now. She's going through her life. Life sucks. She's going through torment, through heartbreak. There's the heart right there. She's definitely going through some heartache. And she's chained up just by that, by the pain she's dealing. Just going through life. Darkness. I mean, God, that's some deep, that's some dark ass shit right there. She's going through some darkness. And she's all by herself. Train's coming. All of a sudden, she's like in this paradox. Lost world. Which is probably like a good definition for like a misery. Because the whole time it sounds like she's miserable. Then she's in front of a crowd of just lifelessness. And right there at the end with the rose. So she must be going through some stuff. Um. So as far as the music. Like I mentioned before. It sounded like very tribal. Uh, yeah, It was more like it is metal. But it definitely sounded like. Like I would say if like Tool. And, like, the Mars Volta had a baby with uh, Amy Lee from uh, Evanescence. I believe that's her name, Amy Lee. This would be the band, but I love the beginning vocals. You could definitely tell there is a man and a female singing. Um, but, you know what? We can go in more in depth in this because I have the website open in the other page and we can tell who the people are. So, like I said, you can check out Ophidian Breeze. And in their song, Dark Flight, it was uh, Angeli Kane. And Josh Holland doing vocals. Um, uh, lead guitar and drums. Zara. Okay, never mind. I got it right here. And Jelly Kane vocals. Josh uh, Holland. Lead guitar, drums, and Zira bass and drums. Let's see. Washington based father daughter band. What? Ophid Ophidian Breeze makes a statement with their debut single, Dark Flight. Ophidian Breeze is an alter uh, alternative. Metal band characterized by heavy hitting instrumental riffage and soaring, soaring female vocals. Technical guitar and bass work create a sense of contrast with powerful and melodic singing throughout Ophidian Breeze's music. The band displays an impressive overall sound and will 
released their first debut EP in the fall. Ophidian Breeze uses meaningful lyrics across their music to convoy tales of loss, facing your inner demons, and emerging from the conflict in victory. That totally makes sense. That totally makes sense. Um, um, strong vocals, strong vocal hooks, talented instrumentals, and an immersive sound of all Allure fans to all will all Allure fans to Ophidian Breeze's work. Sorry for my reading. It's been a long day. And I had a burrito with spicy food. I'm getting like acid right now. That's what happens when you get older. <laughs> uh, with a strong debut song, the band leaves listeners in anticipation of what comes next. This was awesome. I really liked it. Um, Dark Flight, super sick. Let's see where this info takes us. But yeah, check out Ophidian Breeze. Check them out at ophidianbreeze.com. Uh, um, there's songs, there's, uh, let's go to the store, maybe you can buy some, I, I got the sick shirt, so super thank you to them, I appreciate them, yeah, there it is, some merch and stuff, and all sorts of awesome stuff, uh, dude, Ophidian Breeze, dude, check them out, yeah, so, um, tell me, uh, let me know what you thought, uh, this is my first reaction, um, I think they're pretty awesome, it's definitely like a, they do take you through a, a story of emotions, and I definitely want to listen to more. So I will definitely react to some more here on this channel. I am DJ The Don Ramo. Like, comment, and subscribe, and comment below what you thought of the song. I love you guys so much. I will see you guys later. Peace. <laughs>